Welcome back to Bulldog Backfield, where I'm taking you back to the field. On this week's podcast, we have the tennis team here with us. Woo! <laughs> I'd like to introduce you guys to the head coach, Francisco Guerrero, sophomore, Elisa Pequero, and junior, Valentin Popesco. So let's get this show on the road. <laughs> coach, I saw that you used to play for TWU. With this being your third year as coach, how was the transition moving from player to coach? Um, actually, it was pretty good. Um, I played here for four years. Um, I was a team captain my junior and senior year. So I kind of got the sense of helping coach and, and coaching a little bit and trying to help my teammates. So um, it was easier than I expected. So. Uh, I have enjoyed it. I'm going for my third year. Uh, in both sides, we've been really successful on the men's side, on the women's side. So um, I'm really liking it, and I hopefully I can keep going for for many, many more years. Yes, Elisa, I heard that you play two sports. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> I knew instantly I wanted to interview you. So how does it feel to be involved in two sports? Well. I mean, it's fun, but it's tough. It's really mm -hmm. tough because I try to, like, give 100% of me in everything, literally tennis, soccer, school. Like, I just try to be up top with everything. So it's hard, but um, right now I enjoy it, and I love my teammates from both sports. So I think that's the main thing, and I just, I'm happy with it right now. Can I ask you, what's your favorite sport? I'll cover your coach's ears. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to answer. I can answer both, that. Both, both, both. Good answer. She likes both. Both yeah. good answer. Yeah. Valentine, this is your first year with the team, and I heard you won the ITA regional tournament in singles and doubles. How did it feel to come and have success from the jump? It was amazing, and uh, I mean, we practiced really hard, mm -hmm. and... Um, Coach helped us a lot, and during the tournament he was there every match, and the teammates supported me, and uh, they gave me power to fight, because we had multiple matches in, in some days, mm -hmm. and I got pretty tired, but the teammates were there, and the, it was a great energy, and uh, I pulled it off, so I'm really happy with the result. Yes, yeah, so when playing tennis or any sport, you have to have positive energy. You can't have right. negative energy. really important. <coughs> yes. Coach, last season you guys had a record-breaking season with the historical ranking of being 10th in the nation. You guys also qualified for the national tournament for the second year in the row, making it the third time in school history. Yes, third time in school <laughs> history. How did that feel? Um, it felt pretty good. Um, again, we have a great group of guys. Um, we were able to compete well. Um, we are in a super tough conference. We have a lot of good teams, so it's not easy to qualify. Um, we may get to the semifinals in the conference tournament. So we were expecting, we were waiting to see mm -hmm. we were going to qualify, but due to, like, we have a really good ranking, so uh, we were able to, to get in, and then we were able to win one round for the second time. So uh, I'm really happy with the result. We are, we won more this year, so yes. we, we brought some... Um, really good kids, um, Valentin and a couple more freshmen, as well on the women's side, we brought four more girls, I think, or five. So um, our goal is this year try to get both teams to the national tournament, men and women. So I think we, we can do it. Definitely. We just need to put a lot of uh, work. We are doing it, and I think uh, we, we, we may have a chance to do it. So it's yeah, hopefully we can get yeah. both teams. So that yeah. would be awesome. Yes. Now I have a question for both of you guys. What are your goals for this season? Let me start with you, Valentin. Uh, just to compete hard every match and give my best. And in academics this year, I decided to put more time and it's paying off already. I, okay. I'm getting good grades and I'm really happy about it. And um, yeah, just making it to the tournament. And uh, I have the same goal as coach pretty much to be top eight this year. So. Yeah, that's what we, we have. One of the goals we have with the men, since we already were top 10 last year, <laughs> is try to bring into the top eight. So that's, and I think it's a possible goal. So, um, and then on the women's side, we are just ranked outside the top 25 teams in the nation. So we are receiving both. So uh, one good win, <laughs> and we can get into the top 25. And then if we can get into the top 25, um, the chances of going to nationals are higher. So... Uh, we can hopefully get both teams ranked pretty high next year, so 
we're, we're <laughs> shooting for that. I believe in y'all. So in Thank you. Staff, what are your goals? Well, mainly my goal with everything and with both of the sports is just like give 100% in every game, every point, try to be positive and well, I think the main goal for all of the whole team and for him is try to go to Nationals with the, with the goal. So I will do whatever is in my hands so I can get there. Okay. Now my last question is for you, Valentine. What made you choose TWU? I heard that you were previously at a Division One institution. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, main reason is coach. I really like him whenever I talk to him, and that's really important to me to have a person that I can relate to and um, where uh, age is pretty close and uh, I don't know I just really like him and uh, he presented the facility and everything and I like the place it's a small school so mm -hmm. the professor give him more attention mm -hmm. I really like that and um, that's it pretty much okay <laughs> well that is all for today I thank you guys for coming thank you for having us no thank problem it has been a you. joy <laughs> thank you <laughs> now make sure you guys tune in next Thursday on Bulldog Backfield where I'm taking you back to the field bye <laughs>